Hello! In this video, I will show you how to customize your website by changing colors and CMS blocks used in the theme. Specifically, I will change our theme colors to red, change the block in the menu with the links to the pages, and the block with free shipping note in minicart. Important is that Scandi PWA respects Magenta store hierarchy, and all these settings are available on the store view level. I will now go to Backend, Open Stores, Configuration, expand the Scandi PWA section and open Color Customization. I will switch to our Store View and set Enable Color Customization to Yes. And once this is done, I am now available to change my primary and secondary colors. I will now change my primary to red. And save configuration. As you can notice, color and content customization settings are integrated with Magento caching mechanism, so Magento shows you the node to refresh and validate the cache types. I am now able to go back to frontend, refresh the page, and by opening Minicart, I can already notice that the colors were changed, but we can check further and open any product page. You can notice that the buttons here are changed as well. But if I switch to another store view, you can notice that the buttons remain the same. I will go back to my store view. Now it is the time to change CMS blocks, but first I have to create them as the blocks that you can see on website are used as placeholders if nothing is selected in configuration. To save the styling, make sure to use the right class for each block. You can simply inspect your block and copy the HTML. I will go back to backend, content, blocks, and add a new block. and insert my HTML. I will edit the content and save the block. Now I will do the same with the block in menu. I will inspect the block And copy the HTML. Again add a new block and insert my HTML. I will replace the link to the contact page to our Scandi PWA page. Save. And once the blocks are created, I will go back to our store configuration, expand Scandi PWA section, and now open Content Customization. I will switch to our store view and choose our newly created blocks for Minicart.
and menu. Save config. And again, follow the Magento node to refresh and validate the cache types. Now I will open frontend, refresh the page, I will open minicard and you can see the updated node indicating for free shipping and a new link to scan the PWA page in menu which leads to the exact page I have indicated in backend.